<laughs> How's it going guys? This is your boy Hollis Grimm and today we're gonna to be reacting to SEO Bridge episode 5. Yay! <laughs> okay, yeah, you caught me you, you, you caught me on a bad spot. <laughs> Whatever. I don't edit my videos that much anyway, so screw it. And yeah, uh, without further ado, let's get right into it. Is that an end? If that thing hadn't already killed seven of us, I'd say this was a really stupid boss. We'll get just close enough to aggro him. Then, our archers will kite him all the way to the village. Once he's there, he'll be too distracted killing NPCs to notice us. Then, we move in for the kill. Whoa, whoa, whoa! We can't just go around sacrificing NPCs. Some of my best friends have been NPCs. That makes... How many of us cared about the NPCs? Except for the story. Not one of you. Betcha. Not one of you. Way too much sense. We must save my family! <laughs> you see? She doesn't even have fat! Gary. Excuse me! I have to go say hi to an old friend! Who <laughs> won't be a minute? Hey, Gary! Long time no see! We must save my family! <laughs> yeah! Bet you didn't expect to see me again, did you, punk? We must save my family! You left us to die, you bastard! We must save Oh my, my god. Choke so on it. Choke so on my vengeance. How does it taste? Yeah, you know what? Like cherry coke. But maybe he has a point. This is super uncomfortable. Oh my, Kirito got problems, bruh. You're looking pretty relaxed there, buddy. Ah, pretty good. This grass feels amazing. Cool, cool. You, uh, you want to know what I did today? Not particularly, but I suspect that wasn't a real question. I was fighting goddamn sheep tar! It was great! You should have been there! He was climbing the walls, spitting acid! We're still talking about a sheep, right? Not like a fluffy xenomorph. It's a <laughs> oh, Jesus. stupid boss! Apparently not that stupid if it killed seven of you. Twelve now. Actually. Oh, well, that's a thing. But I mean, you survived. So, hey, silver lining. Okay, what the hell is wrong with you? You're Bro. way too mellow. Well, I, know, right? I had some time to kill before the raid, so I figured I'd power level my alchemy a bit by eating some weird plants. And now everything's just great. Oh my god. He higher than a guy, bro. <laughs> Say something for me. No, just kidding. Don't do that. Don't do drugs, kids. <laughs> Don't do drugs. I can't believe this. You're the one that insisted we couldn't use the NPCs as bait. And then you go in. Asna, Asna, Asna. Look, okay? I get it. You had a really bad day. You're stressed out. Seven people died. Twelve people! Not the point. Look, they're dead now. And really, whose fault is that? Yours! That's right. No one's. So why don't you lie down, relax, and watch the stars? It's two in the afternoon. There are no stars. Only if you're looking with your eyes. What the hell does that mean? Only one way to find out. You better come down soon so I can kick your teeth in. Okay, what happened? Oh, he's up now. Ah, uh, uh, good now. What the? Asuna? What is she doing here? Ah, looks like someone's having a good time. A boy becomes a man. <laughs> Come on, guys. Let's give them some privacy. Huh. In the open? Those two bros make an interesting point. There's an... Really? In the open? Nah. Nah. Hey, cool, man. I don't want to see that when I walk into a park. Some of y'all are freaks out there, and you know exactly who you are. Y'all be doing some... <laughs> With some messed up crap in public. <laughs> Above average girl sleeping next to me, and no one around to interrupt. I mean, as a man, there's really only one option here. <laughs> Kirito? Oh. Okay, not what I was thinking. <gasps> hey, sleepyhead, how was your. Ah, tell me what you did right now! And you may live! Had your whiskers on your face! What? Had your cat whiskers on you because I thought it would be funny and it was! Is. In his defense, it is pretty damn funny. <laughs> is that all? Um, yeah? You were asleep. What else would I have done? 
Well, I, 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 I mean, you know, you, you could have, like, do you want to get something to eat? He could have done the nasty. Ah, restaurant. The finest cuisine in all of Aincrad. Oh my god. Are you really going to complain about a free meal? <sighs> Serves me right for trying to do something nice for you. Yeah, remind me to Does she still have this stuff on her face? I'll eat like a king. Or at least a very wealthy janitor. <laughs> this oh, okay. coming from the guy who ate random plants off the ground. Oh really? Well, who's dumber? Me or the one who takes a nap next to some crazed drug fiend? Need I remind you that you were that drug fiend? <laughs> I can't be held responsible for stoned Kirito. That guy's an idiot. Are you kidding me? You're the same person! <laughs> oh, looks like we are out of time. We'll have to continue this next week. But in the meantime, please enjoy these lovely consolation prizes from the Kirito is Always Right Foundation. Oh. Oh my god, you're insufferable! Oh my god! Huh, look, a human pinata. Kirito, he's dying! Bro, he did just not say that. Bro, that is dark. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, correction, he's suffering. The town's a safe zone. Probably hurts like a bitch, but he's not gonna die in here. <gasps> hey man, when you pop, could you try to send the candy over this way? I'm gonna go cut him down, you jackass! I'll save you a Kit Kat! Hey, anybody I got like, like a 30 foot stick? I wanna take a crack at this thing! Please! Help. Oh, don't be such a drama queen! Asuna's gonna have you down, eh? Oh. Huh. So, did anyone see where the candy went, or. For Christ's sake, Yuito! A man just died! Let it go! Once again, Asuna, you can't die in a safe zone. It must have been an event or a prank. Someone messing with an NPC. Oh, yeah, that's a real Damn. hilarious prank. I know, right? I'm kind of sad I didn't think of it. Um, excuse me. My name Where's is Where's she popping up? I knew the man who just died. <laughs> you, uh, you mean NPC, right? N no, his name was Kynes. We came into town to have dinner, but we got separated. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> I'm suspicious. I'm suspicious. So, the Kirito is always right, Foundation? We're, uh, going through a bit of a roast. I mean, they're basically neighbors. You can understand my mistake. Of course. It's a yo, 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 <laughs> ya, yo, yoga pants? Yoko! Okay, fine, god. Yoga pants? I just want to prove I was right. There's no way that guy's really dead. There's something else going on here, and I'm gonna prove it. Wow, how noble of you. Oh, spare me, Wonder Woman. You're only doing this to prove I was wrong. Hey, yep. at least I pretend to be nice to people! Yeah, whatever. Wait, pretend? Hey, Thunder Lion, how's it hanging? Kirito? Well, if it isn't my least favorite customer. Nah, you just say that because I'm not dumb enough to buy any of your crap. Yeah, well, if there's one upside to being trapped with these idiots, it's that they'll buy pretty much anything. <gasps> What's the matter with you? Why would you bring her here? I thought we were friends. What? I don't understand. What's the problem? Hey, T-Dog. What is up in this his house? Is she really trying to speak ghetto? Really? Really? We're gonna go with that right now? No. I ain't buying that. <laughs> Are you crying? There's just so much beauty in the world, you know? So that's the sitch. Think you can scope the deets on this gap for us, homie? Sure thing, Kirito. Anything for a friend. Um, but I'm the one that asked you chocolate rain. Stipe? <laughs> Why you ignore me, bro? Did she really just say chocolate rain? No! No! <laughs> oh, man. She just stopped while she's... Never mind, she's too deep in this. You got hmm. cotton in your ears? Oh god, I I didn't mean it like that! I'm really sorry, Tiff. Grand Wizard Asuna here is not what you'd call a people person. Um, excuse me? Mr. Kettle, Mr. Pot called. He says you're black! What? It's a turn of phrase. It has nothing to do with race. I'm sorry, it's just you look like a very angry black man. Okay, now you see that? That was racist. Yeah. Ah, this is great. See, we're learning stuff. 
But in all seriousness, Tiff, could you check out this weapon before Asna starts a full-on race war? I'll try, but appraising a weapon like this ain't going to be easy. Wow, I can see you've really mastered your craft. Hmm, guilty though. Says it's player made. A guy by the name of Grimlock. Other than that, nothing weird about it. Certainly nothing that lets you kill in a safe zone. Hmm. Well, only one way to be sure. Jesus Christ, what the hell are you doing? Testing well, it out. clearly I'm stabbing myself with a sword to see if it kills me. Oh God, what am I doing? This thing's too dangerous for you to screw Dang. around with. Here, T-Fizzle, you take it. I handed the black man a murder weapon. Carol as old as time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Restaurant. I haven't been here in hours. Glad to see the old place hasn't changed. Do you really hate this place that much? Or do yes. you just love the sound of your own voice? It's my Both. gift to the world. Hate to break it to you, sweetie, but the world wants a gift receipt. No refunds or exchanges, only store credit. Uh, I'm sorry. D didn't you want to ask me some questions? Shh. The grown-ups are talking. Chito! <sighs> I'm sorry, Yoko, but have you ever heard of a player named Grimlock? <gasps> well, that seems pretty definitive. So how do you know this guy? According to our investigation, he's the one who forged the sword that was used in the... incident. Murder? Really? Then show me the body. There is no body! I rest my case. It's SAO! There's never a body! Well, isn't that convenient? Con can I just jump back in here? Yes, please. Maybe you can clear this up. Was there any reason Kynes would have wanted to fake his death? What? Fake his death? You mean Kynes isn't dead? No, oh, of course he's dead. Oh, uh, right. Now, Asuna, you can't prove that he's dead. Let me give this poor girl some hope. Oh, don't even pretend wow. that's what you're doing. Ugh, fine, Asuna, I'll humor you. Yoko, why would Grimlock have wanted to make sweet love to your friend's chest with the business end of a broadsword? Bruh! Jesus Christ, Kirito! So what? Dark. I asked her! Jeez, I just can't win with you. Um, well, it might have something to do with his wife's murder. Six months ago, the guild that Kynes, Grimlock, and I were a part of found an extremely valuable item. Rather than fight over it, we decided to sell it and split the profits. But when Grimlock's wife Griselda went out to make the sale, she was killed. Since we were the only ones who knew about the item, we realized the killer had to be one of us, and the guild just fell apart. Well, that sounds like motive to me. Meh, yeah, I've killed for less. But why would Grimlock have suspected Kine? <laughs> well, when I said we decided to sell the item... <laughs> it's like, it's like, I killed for less. Hey, man. It wasn't exactly unanimous. Kynes, I, and another player voted to keep it. A lancer named Schmidt. Sounds like you're not a fan. What? No! Oh, we're still good friends, actually. Schmidt, Schmidt. Why does that name sound familiar? You know him? I think so. Oh, God, no! I knew it! They're finally coming for me! It was only a matter of time! The walls are closing in! Is he always like this? Only when he's stressed. Well, that's a relief. He's always stressed. God damn it! He used to review games back in the real world, but ever since he got trapped in here, he's been terrified that his more verbose commenters are going to make good on their threats. I used to laugh at their comments. You hear me? Laugh! But now, what if they actually do chop off my limbs, rip out my intestines, and ride me like some sort of meat toboggan? Hear that, Asuna? Meat toboggan. Try getting that image out of your head. Gripping his entrails like the reins of Santa's sleigh, streaking through the fresh morning snow on a trail of bile and gore, as his eyes beg the same question as the horrified children in his wake. Bro, is he okay? Like, for real, is he okay? Bro. Why? Oh, God! Did you just shut up and let her handle this? Go on, Yoko. Calm down. No one's going to kill you over your review, Schmidt. Really? Are you sure? My viewers aren't coming for me? That's right. But Grimlock is. And he's coming to deliver righteous vengeance upon us. <laughs> this may have been a mistake. I disagree. I think you got a real flair for this. That's not helping! Wait, no. That can't be it. Kynes was killed in a safe zone. Grimlock couldn't be the killer. Thank you! Finally, a voice of reason. It must have been Chris. Say 
reason? Sorry, I meant the screaming monkeys that live in her brain. It's all our fault. We should have just done whatever Griselda wanted. There's no stopping her judgment now. And you're okay with this? I don't know about you, but I have a duty to my fans to survive this game. I mean, to the ones who aren't threatening to use my spine as a pitching wedge. Settle down, you two. Jesus. I think we can safely assume a ghost is not the culprit here. Right, Kirito? Of course not. Obviously, it was a hit by the mermaid mafia paid in leprechaun gold. But who was the this puppet guy. master? The unicorns? No, they've had a feud going with the mermaids for years. Damn it, Kirito! This is serious! These people's lives are in danger! No, they're not! For the last time, you can't die in a safe zone! Yoko! Kirito, is she okay? Well, I'm not a doctor, but I don't like her chances. Me neither. Oh crap, that's it? You serious? Well, alrighty, uh, that was SAO Bridge episode 5. If you guys like this kind of content, please, please, please hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, please comment down below, let me know what you guys think. I'm gonna continue the SAO Bridge story, don't worry about that, it's gonna be in future videos. And I'll leave you guys on that remark, and I hope you have a wonderful night, day, morning, whatever time it is you guys are watching this. <laughs> Peace out.